this is Jim Lakey with news and announcements for St. John and Maxville, Kansas. On Cable Channel 3 and on SandyLandCenter.org, our website. Today is Friday, the 17th of April, and it's uh, 65 degrees here in the square and light rain. Now, today uh, is supposed to have uh, thunderstorms later on, and uh, there's an 80% chance, and uh, the high temperature will be 73. <clears throat> then uh, Saturday is saying partly cloudy, although that's a change from what we heard before, and 76, so partly cloudy Saturday, 76. Showers on Sunday, 64, the high temperature, with a 60% chance of rain. And then we're done with the rain, unless the forecast changes. Monday and Tuesday are both partly cloudy, 64 on Monday, 68 on Tuesday. And Wednesday, the first sunny day in a while, with 70 degrees on Wednesday. <coughs> we have... No birthdays for today, but for Saturday, happy birthday to Mike Leroy, and for Sunday, happy anniversary to Emerson and Jan Shields. We hope that you all enjoy your special days, and that the weather doesn't change and uh, keep you from whatever it is that you plan for a celebration. Well, we have uh, two trips left for the Recreation Commission this month. On Tuesday, April 21st, <clears throat> they're going to the Martin County Hysterical Society in Great Bend, Kansas. And they're going to have lunch at the Great Wall. So they leave at 10, and they have lunch at 12.15, and they come back by 4. The transportation fee is $8, and the trip is, the lunch is on yourself. Uh, then on uh, Thursday, there's a combined trip, either Swacker's Senior Expo for 2015 or the Dodge City Casino. And they're going to leave at 8 and uh, come back at 3, or they leave Dodge at 3, and there's no fee for this trip. Uh, so this is provided by the St. John uh, Recreation Commission. <clears throat> and then we have the highlight of the news every day, and that is going to be the menus. At the Sunflowers today, they have a minstrel soup. And on Monday, Yankee Pie Roast. And on Tuesday, Chicken and Noodles. And Chicken Strips on uh, next Wednesday. <clears throat> While at the Maxfield VIP Center, they're having barbecued beef and potato salad today. Then they have two choices for Monday, baked tilapia and barbecue ribette with a baked potato. Sloppy Joe's on Tuesday and on Wednesday, sweet and sour chickens. <laughs> sweet and, and sour chicken. Uh, only one. Uh, so, uh, that's all of the news and announcements. Uh, stay tuned for the message about God's story. <clears throat> and the word of the day is this. Here is a recipe for trouble. Believe everything you hear, and then repeat it to everybody. This is Jim Blakey, hoping you have a nice, safe weekend. This is your story. This is your story. This is your story. This is my story. This is my story. This is my story. But most of all, this is the greatest story ever told. This is God's story. This is God's story. This is God's story. I know you're going to enjoy the incredible journey you're about to embark on. The story is brimming over with tales of mystery, intrigue, adventure, of love, heartbreak, and triumph, of power, of struggle, and finally, of redemption. 
But remember, the Bible is not a hundred ancient, unrelated paintings, but a mural all knitted together to tell the story of God's great love for us and the extent to which He will go to get us back. I know you're really going to enjoy and appreciate this wonderful experience as you fully explore how we all fit into the greatest story ever told, God's story. This is God's story. This is God's story. This is God's story. I'm Ray Davidson, pastor of First Southern Baptist Church here in St. John on the corner of Second and Exchange. We would like to invite you to come and join with us as we look at God's story, the story of God's interaction with man. We'll begin on September the 7th at 9.30 a.m. with, uh, with a worship service followed by at 10.30 with Sunday School. This is a study for everyone in the family. All of the children, young people, adults will be studying the same lesson so that we can talk about it at home as we go through the week. We invite you again to come and join us on this 31-week study of God's story and man's story.